May is Skin Cancer Awareness Month, and there's one woman who wants to use her experience to hopefully teach you. We do want to warn you, the images that she posted on Facebook that we're about to show you may be difficult to see, but it's exactly why she posted them. Tawny Willoughby says she hopes these pictures will convince people to stay out of tanning beds. This was her experience. She had skin cancer removed from her body every year for the past six years. Her video went viral. It's been shared on Facebook more than 50,000 times. She was first diagnosed with skin cancer when she was 21 years old. She says she used a tanning bed four to five times a week when she was a teenager. Dr. Lillian Shapiro is here with us now to talk about the dangers of tanning, some alternatives. But doctor, I, I, my first reaction to this was, this is an extreme example, surely. It can't be something that could happen to anyone that uses tanning beds. Even just using a tanning bed once increases your risk of skin cancer 20%. So five minutes in the tanning bed is like two hours outside. These welts on her face, is that an extreme reaction? No, that, is a, that is a normal reaction to the medication that she had to use on her face for one of her many, many episodes with skin cancer. One of the things that I also thought was, does anyone really even use tanning beds anymore? It seemed like something that was in the 80s or 90s. You oh no, so a much. third of women of white women 18 to 25 are using tanning beds, primarily in the Midwest and South, and they are increasing their risk of melanoma, which is the most deathly type of skin cancer that Tawny hasn't even had. So she did not even have the worst kind of skin cancer. But, but tanning increases your risk of melanoma by 74%. I believe that's the worst kind of skin cancer. Let's talk a little bit about some alternatives. Yes. Uh, you know, you have laying out in the sun, just as dangerous? Yes, but less intense. So again, five minutes in the tanning salon equals two hours outside. Mm -hmm. And all tans are damage to your skin. All tanning is ultraviolet light damaging your skin. And wrinkles, ladies, wrinkles, yes. wrinkles. So what are we talking here? Spray tans or? Spray tans and being comfortable in your own skin. And particularly the young women, 18 to 25 years old, who are tanning, are, it's an age when many young women face body image issues. Mm -hmm. And to be comfortable in your own skin is a great place to start. About 10 states at least now have laws that you can't tan under 18, but you can go online and buy your own home tanning bed for $1,500. Yeah. I mean, it's so accessible and so, so dangerous. And such great information, especially for the folks out there, this being uh, Awareness Month, the month of May. Dr. Lillian Shapiro, thanks so much for being with us.